morning everyone how are you all i hope you all are absolutely fine today you all are able to guess what exactly we are going to learn yes what is this this is clock what is this clock and through this clock we will learn time isn't it a clock or a watch has numbers from 1 to 12 let's count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 and 12 right there are two hands in a watch two hands one and two the short hand is the hour hand and the long hand is the minute hand right when the hour hand moves from one number to another we call it one hour listen carefully when the hour hand moves from one number to another we call it one hour right and the minute hand moves faster than the hour hand it completes one full circle of the watch phase in one hour this hand this long hand completes one full circle of the watch phase in one hour this hand is faster than the short hand long hand the minute hand moves faster than the hour hand right we usually read time in hours and minutes in hours and minutes when the minute hand is at 12 when this hand minute hand the long hand is at 12 the hour hand tells us what time it is see this hand short hand is at 9 this is hour hand and this minute hand is at 12 it means this is 9 o'clock what is the time this is 9 o'clock the hour hand goes round the clock in 12 hours because when it moves from one number to another it means this is 1 hour so it completes in 12 hours right okay children a day has 24 hours how many hours are there in a day 24 hours so the hour hand has to take two rounds of the clock in one day two rounds one two like this only in one day so it completes 24 hours a day divides into four parts morning afternoon evening and night four parts are there of a day morning afternoon evening and night right okay children now let's practice for time what is the time now the hour hand is at 10 and the minute hand is at 12 it means this is 10 o'clock what is the time 10 o'clock now hand will tell the time only hour hand hour hand is at 6 it means this time is 6 o'clock what is the time 6 o'clock now tell me the minute hand is at 12 means hour hand is going to tell us the time hour hand is at 3 so it means this is 3 o'clock what is the time 3 o'clock let's practice more now you tell me what is the time absolutely right this is 8 o'clock because hour hand is at 8 and minutes hand is at 12 so this time is 8 o'clock right now tell me what is the time yes 
this is one o'clock because our hand is at one and the minute hand is at twelve. This is one o'clock. Now tell me the time. Yes, this is five o'clock. Our hand is at five and the minute hand is at twelve. So it is five o'clock. Okay, what's the time now? Yes, it is eleven o'clock because our hand is at eleven and minute's hand is at twelve. I hope now you all are able to understand how we can read the time. This is the one pattern of time, right? Let's learn more from this clock only. Okay, children, do you know? Each number is having gap of five minutes. Do you know the table of five? Let's see. Five twos are ten. Five threes are fifteen. Five fours are twenty. Five fives are twenty-five. Five sixes are thirty. Five sevens are thirty-five. Five eights are forty. Five nines are forty-five. Five tens are fifty. Five elevens are fifty-five. And five twelves are sixty, right? So this is totally sixty minute of round. Now let's learn what is this. When the hour hand is at any number and the minute hand is at nine, it means water to that number. See, the hour hand is at twelve. And minutes hand is at nine. It means the time is quarter to twelve. What is the time? Quarter to twelve. It means after fifteen minutes, it will be twelve o'clock. The time will be twelve o'clock. But right now the time is quarter to twelve. Now tell me the time. When the hour hand is at three, and the minutes hand is at nine. The time is quarter to three. What is the time? Quarter to three. After fifteen minutes, it will be three, right? Now, what is the time? Absolutely right. It's quarter to five, isn't it? What's the time now? Yes, it is quarter to seven. Now, I hope you all are able to understand the concept of quarter to. Right now, I'll clear the concept of quarter past. Let's learn. Okay, children. When the minute hand is at three, when the minute hand is at three, and the hour hand is at any number, it means the quarter past of that number. Let's learn what is the time right now. Quarter past twelve. Earlier it was quarter two, but now it's quarter past twelve. Means before fifteen minutes it was twelve o'clock, right? Okay, children. Now tell me what is the time? Yes, this is quarter past ten, right? Because minutes hand is at three. Now tell me what is the time? It's quarter past eight. Our hand is at eight, and the minutes hand is at three. Hey, what is the time now? Yes, this is quarter past six. Minutes hand is at three, and the hour hand is at six. Now tell me what is the time? Yes, it's quarter past four. Quarter past four. I hope now you all are able to understand the concept of quarter past. Now let's learn what is the meaning of half past. Let's learn the half past concept, right? Okay, babies. When the minutes hand is at six, it means half past. The full circle is from one to twelve, and the half of twelve is. Six. When the minute hand is at six, it means half past, right? And the hour hand will tell the time. 
So this time is half past seven because our hand is at seven and the minutes hand is at six. So this is half past seven. Now what is the time? This is half past nine. Right? Half past nine. Okay, now tell me what is the time? It's half past eleven. What is the time? Half past eleven. Now tell me what is the time? It's half past two. Half past two because our hand is at two and the minute's hand is at six. This is half past two. This is half past five. Half past five. So children, what exactly today we have learned? The time, minute hand, hour hand, full time, quarter to, quarter past and half past. Right. What exactly you have to do now? Yes, you have to do lots of practice of it. You can do one activity too. Just like me, you just make a clock and do practice like this only. This will be a game for you too. You just play this game with your friends. You can set the hands of the clock like me and ask questions from your friends. Right. It will be a lovely game for you. So don't wait. Hurry up. Make a clock and play this game. Very soon I will meet you in the next video. Till then. Bye bye. Take care.